President Al Kufuado has broken the ground for work to begin on the Achima and Yabijat, North District of the Shanti region. It's to be named after the former President John Ejekum Kufu as a befitting recognition and honor for the statesman for his contribution to the nation's development. The project has been undertaken by the State Housing Company, first phase of the company's housing project in the Ashanti region this year. Second phase will comprise 1,000 housing units for the staff of the Ghana Health Service at Sewa and the Bosunpi districts. The project is expected to create about 1,000 direct and indirect jobs for mostly local people. The managing director of the estate housing company, Mr. Kwabinam Povapia, said the company had started work on many other housing projects in parts of the country aimed at addressing the housing problems for particularly public servants. A deputy minister for works and housing, Madam Frida Prempe, said the country is presently facing a housing deficit to the tune of about 1.7 million. This project by the state housing company will not only bring relief to the people of Oyoko Akro from, but will enhance development and also generate about 4,000 direct and indirect jobs. I hope the contractors will explore and incorporate the use of local building materials, add value to our local resources to ensure the president's vision of Ghana beyond aid becoming a reality. President Kufu already described the naming of this estate after former President Kufu as very appropriate considering the contribution is made to the development of the country. The decision taken by the Minister for Works and Housing, Atatia, to name this estate after my old boss, John Ajakum Kufu, as my complete support. I think that in recognition of all that he did to address the housing deficit when he was president, this is a very fitting tribute and it is a privilege for me to be able to honor my old boss, John Ajakum Kufu. I assure the people of the Ashanti region, especially those in the Akuma Wabinia districts, that in the coming weeks, the finance minister will list $27 million the contractor work on the Sofu Line interchange and realization of a portion of the Sunyani Road for him to resume work on the project.